Pretty enough in a bossy kind of way, but Pukapatra is the number one cutie in ancient Egypt. I see. Well, in that case, there's only one thing to do. Get rid of Pukapatra! <laughs> it's Pukapatra, cutest girl in all of ancient Egypt. Such beauty, over. <laughs> Such grace. Such a pain in my tootin' common. I'll give that Pukapatra a new look that will wipe the pretty right off her little face. Come in, fair one. I'll anoint you with Egyptian oils and creams, making you so beautiful that no boy can resist you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start with a Nile mud mask. <laughs> now I am truly the number one babe in ancient Egypt. <laughs> The god of chaos, you must go! Oh, great Seth! The dog headed god of chaos! Tell me what I must do! So you want to lay the ugly on Puka Patra? I've got just the thing that will do the trick. Simply hit her with this ugly stick. Eek. Well, if anyone knows about ugly, it's you. <laughs> Just checking. Ah, oh, what a cute girl. Oh, it ain't nothing. Oh, it's Puka Patra. She's so pretty. <laughs> oh. Oh. What? So, Puka Patra, you think you're so pretty. Well, say hello to my ugly little friends. That color really brings out your eyes. There must be some way to take the giggle out of that girl. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Puka's lovely smile will certainly disappear if Garu were no longer here. There is only room 
for one queen of the Nile. Ain't that the Personality, good looks, nice hair, a boyfriend. So bad. <laughs> Us bunnies are sick of being used for your magic tricks. <laughs> oh, Garu, nice to see you. <laughs> Why, hello there, handsome. <laughs> What a woman! Earth to Abio, what are you thinking? Puka, 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 puka! I need that wand to get my Abio back. Do you like my new hairdo? <laughs> Hey! <laughs> 
<laughs> you two would probably like to be alone, so I'll be going now. Oh my, it seems there's no way out. <laughs> to tie the knot. Chef Alberto has made the world's largest noodle. He's filled the Roman Colosseum. And after we showed him how to make them, oh, we'll just have to make a bigger noodle. How much bigger? Around the world! Have a great warrior spirit to run around the world pulling a noodle. Mm -hmm. If Gero does not return with the noodle, his shame will be overwhelming. <laughs> and whoever brings the noodle home will be a hero. That's going to be me.
comes by, we strike like lightning. <laughs> Fools, I said strike like lightning. What makes snow angels? <laughs> Finish his mission while lost in space. <laughs> Sacre bleu! That mime, he spoke! I smell defeat for Garu and victory for me. Let's see how he likes ten thousand pounds of booger boulder. <laughs> President's always kissing. Uh, who cares, Abner? Just come on and get your hot dog. This time we must not fail. I want Garu's noodles. <laughs> <laughs> Your girlfriend betrays you. What? You'll pay for this, Garu. I'll be back. our noodle. And what a big noodle it was. Isn't love funny? <laughs> Everyone in Sugar Village loves getting fortunes. 
And they should, because Turtle's fortunes always come true. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> that's a good one. Deliver your fortunes to everyone! Oh, look before you leap. Well, we'll see about that. Uh, these fortunes are always right. Oh, 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 oh. When yawning, always cover mouth. Ah, that's stupid. <laughs> always be prepared to clean up after your battles. Finding the perfect gift will result in a kiss. Hey, great fortune. I guess you'll be getting a gift for Garu. But what? It must be perfect. Mm. You will know the perfect gift when you see it. <laughs> Garu's in for a long day. <laughs> <laughs> You will write me a fortune. A dangerous fortune. Fortune cookies are not toys for a boy to play with. Do I look like I want to play with a toy? I think vengeance. Now, less talking, more writing. Read this. <laughs> <laughs> My brilliance is rivaled by none. When Gero reads this, I will strike the ultimate blow. I offer a final warning. Do not toy with the cookies. What do you know? You're just a turtle who writes fortunes. Uh, you might not want to read that. <laughs> oh, great. Who could better not mess this up? You will know the perfect gift when you see it. No! Puka may think she is clever, but I will get that cookie back. Then Garu will be doomed. Nope, I haven't seen Garu all day. Did you check his house? Closer. <laughs> Closer. Less talking, more training. <laughs> Harder! Harder! <laughs> So, you thought you could fill the city with rabid weasels? Your crime spree is over. Over. We were framed! We didn't know there were weasels! Sorry, Puka. I haven't seen Garu at all. Over. <laughs> ah, Puka. Have you given Garu his gift yet? You want I should go out there and find him? How would you find him? I have ways. There, just a few more inches and the cookie will be... No, no. Oh, my fortune said the garbage this puzzle would break down today. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. What 
is Gero doing here? Yes, this is better than I could have planned. Gero's own girlfriend is my unknowing accomplice. Oh, vengeance is sweet. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Let's go on. Do it. What's the matter with you? You, you, you? you cannot just discard a fortune. You have to read it like this. He who reads this fortune shall explode. There. Oh! <laughs> Thank you for rescuing me, Garu. I knew giving you that fortune this morning would work. I warned you not to play with fortune cookies, Tobey. They have powerful magic. Right, Puka? The only table I have is near the kitchen and the chefs. I wouldn't sit there, but you can have it if you want it. <laughs> then guide my sleigh, little busboy. <laughs> Break another pair of nunchucks. Over. Yes, Dad. I need money for a new pair, but I don't have enough. Well, son, I've heard stories about a wondrous sofa with an insatiable appetite for pocket change. Over. Must have amassed a fortune by now. Over. Fortune? How much? Oh, where can I find this sofa? Tell me! Tell me! I swore a sacred oath to never tell. Over. <sighs> it's at the restaurant, over and out. You've been a good little busboy. Let Santa leave you a tip. Uh, hmm, Santa seems to be missing all his spare change. I'll get you next time. <laughs> oh, that's what they all say. Appetite for pocket change. Now let us find some treasure. Around here somewhere. 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 Uh, uh, somewhere. Uh, 
your table. You can sit on our comfy sofa while you wait. On that? It's gotta be here. I bet I'm close. This is not worth the price of soup. <laughs> Treasure. And it's mine! All mine! Garu! <laughs> what are you doing here? So, think you can steal my treasure, eh? Huh? I That's our sofa! It runs with such grace. You still can't have any of my treasure, Garu! It's all of mine! Hey, hey, hey! What's all the ruckus about? Oh, it's you. I told you a thousand times, you just don't match the new wallpaper! I gave you away, and you belong at the restaurant now. We can't ask our customers to sit on that. The uh, springs would make for an awkward situation. You know what I'm saying? Oh, who could even afford to have it repaired? Oh, well, that was unexpected. No, I was heard there was treasure in that thing. <laughs> it looks like Puka found a treasure of her own. <laughs> Oh, all right. We'll use the money to have you here posters. Hello? Garu? Someone get me out of here! How do you feel about checkers and hearts? I had no idea Puko is such a craftsman. I love how it compliments the walls. And it has much more room. <laughs> mm, I really love this flower. Abio, what do you think? Huh? Yeah, pretty, I guess. <laughs> gets a sniff of its scent, will fall fast asleep, and then dream all about one's true wishes. Ah, so we have nothing to worry about, right? Not so fast, because during that dream, once that wish finally comes true, you will stay asleep forever. What? This must mean that Garu is nearby. Found him, my love. Hold on. Uh? All is not lost. There is a way to awaken Puka from her slumber. What is it? Tell us, Master Sue. Someone needs to enter her dream and stop her wish from coming true. What? Come on, let's take a peek. Yeah! Oh my! <laughs> 
The dream has already begun. Huh? It must be her marriage with Garu. She what? How dare she marry him in her dreams? Whoa! Hurry! You must enter her dream and stop this marriage from happening! You can count on us! Koopa, I'll make sure you wake up. <laughs> no! Don't wait for me, Garu! I, I'm getting too old for this. <laughs> Look at that! Hmm? <laughs> Hello, my friend! You scared me! You folks must be here to celebrate the wedding of the universe's most handsome man, Garu! And Tuka's wedding, too. It's about to begin! Let's go! <laughs> that really, Tobe? Ah. How happy Garu must be. How about we get married, Ching? What? <laughs> If I get a proper proposal. What more can I say than, I love you? Oh dear, everyone's in love in Puka's dream. I can't stand this much longer. <laughs> Welcome, everyone. I am greatly honored to help celebrate the wedding of two special lovebirds here at the beautiful Dong King. So let the ceremony begin. Today's star, I give you Puka. Puka is so pretty. Do you take Puka as your lawfully wedded wife? <laughs> Do you take Garu as your lawfully wedded husband? Mm -hmm. The bride and groom will now face each other and profess their love. Music, please. Oh, how romantic. Ching! Huh? When's this thing over, anyway? Oh, yeah! Puka, <gasps> this marriage can't Ooh. go on! What is this? We're gonna lose her! Stop there, trespasser. You guys are a toast! Hey, Master Sue! Can you hear us? Help, please! Help is on the way! Hold your horses! Hey, what happened to the good old days when things were easy? <laughs> so this is Puka's dream, huh? My girl, here you are! What's this? Hey, what do you think you're doing, huh? Uh, well, you see... How dare you do this without my permission? Hmm? Why did we do it? Release them, now! Yes, ma'am. Thanks, Ring Ring. Great timing. <laughs> Where are you going, Garu? Now, we will conclude the ceremony with their first kiss as husband and wife. Hmm... <laughs> in your wedding, so we can keep you here. Good job, Garu. Oh, Garu, you really are the best. What's happening now? I think it's time we go back. Safe. 
Thank goodness we did not have to use the ultimate strategy. What? There was another solution? Of course. All I needed to do was ring this gong. But the truth is, I can't stand the sound of it. What? Why, you stupid old... <laughs> Anymore. Oh, yes. We shall duel later. Meet me at dawn, and I will defeat you in front of the entire village. Agreed. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid Jeru. If I can rob him of sleep, I can rob him of victory. So tonight, I will find a way to keep him awake. Then, come morning, he will be dead tired, and I will be ready to help him, shall we say, rest in peace. <laughs> <laughs> Shaolin Betty by style is very impressive. But it is no match for my Suga water torture. Drink up, my nemesis. Drink from the spring of vengeance. <laughs> Where's the hose? Mommy! Babies, enjoy your candy. For soon, I will snatch it away, and your annoying screams will then awaken Garu. <laughs> now, stop with the goo goo and make with the wah wah. Well, why is there no crying? Come on, Whoa. stop it! The bad baby, bad. <laughs> Starlight, Star Bright, Carol will definitely not sleep tonight. Especially after I redirect air traffic over his house. Terrestrial hijacker, do you have any idea who you are? Ha! You missed me. Ooh, ow, 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 that hurts. Ooh. 
<laughs> I have enough fireworks to fire near Garo's window all night long. Beginning with you, my big shiny weapon of mass disruption. <laughs> this can't be good. Certainly. That woke him up. <laughs> Trapped! It's morning! Today, our rivalry ends, for I shall smite you with all my... Uh, 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 uh.